Cleanup is underway at the homeless encampment site across the Micronesia Mall. Maintenance workers from the Dededo Mayor's office worked their way through what's left after government of Guam officials stormed the private property yesterday. John Raigu says the cleanup started this morning. We just started today because yesterday they had all the processing to be done and there were people around. So we don't want to clean anything. There's people, there's movement around me for the safety of the people. Several junk cars, multiple bags of trash, push carts filled with cans, and a billowing canopy are among the items left behind. Department of Public Works also on site to transport the junk cars to Global Recycling Center. When asked on his thoughts on the controversial homeless relocation initiative, Niraigu says this. Well, it's good for them. They're going to have a nice place to live. If they accept all the government assistance that the, that the government got to give, because a lot of them, they, they don't really like the rules and regulations, you know. They want, their, they want to leave free, not to be told to do anything or whatever. Also helping to clean from the Dededo mayor's office, maintenance worker Julian Teza admitting while it is sad, he is focused on doing his job. It's sad, but it's uh, also good because uh, it's not in, uh, we're just relocating them. Uh, my thoughts are... They're, this one's not that bad because they, they were organized. I'm just here to do my job. Throughout the week, community members have been taking to our social media pages to voice their concerns calling for a more permanent solution, such as more affordable housing and questioning the mobilization of SWAT officers. Matsuki Hariyama, KUAM News.